Hello everyone, this is Admiral Plerovsky bringing you Atlantic Fleet Single Battle Convoy PQ-13 29th of March 1942 Arctic Convoy PQ-13 is en route from Iceland to Murmansk, Russia when three German destroyers sail out to intercept Historical outcomes, Z-26 sunk Trinidad heavy damage Eclipse Heavy Damage, Z25 Light Damage. Right, so we've got all these. Right, mm hmm. Alright, here we go. I have a light cruiser and is it three or four destroyers. Let's just have a look at the map first. To see how things... Oh, they're heading straight for us. I see. Um, right. Um, you go hard a port then. These are Crown Colony, aren't they? Yeah, Crown Colony class light cruiser. Right. And they're really close as well. 9596. It seems the um the light cruiser will have to do most of the work here. 10.8 is suggested. I'm gonna go 10.5. Let's go 10.5. And we will use high explosive shells, I think. There we go. Shoot! Good, that's not too bad, that's not too bad. We've got the Fury Destroyer. The Fury is all the way down here. Um, can we reach them, perhaps, or not? Not really. Although I will try, nevertheless. Go hard a port. Is that 24? It's down here. Is that 26 down here? I think what we'll do is we'll go for the Z24 with the Fury and the Aribi will go for the Z26. Yeah, let's do that. They're saying 21.9. Let's try 21.7. And we'll see where that takes us. 21.7, high explosive, shoot! Little bit short, little bit short, a little bit more welly was required for that one, I think. Hard port. And you, meanwhile, will go for the Z26. There we go. 29.8, that's a very high suggestion. I don't have anything better to suggest myself, so I will go broad I will broadly speaking follow this suggestion. Once we actually fire away some shots, we'll be able to, you know we'll be able to use our own guesses. We won't necessarily have to follow the suggestion every time at that point. And the Eclipse is a bit too far away, I think, to have any meaningful impact. At least for now. Yeah, 16,000 away. I think we'll just have the Eclipse go up to flank and you make smoke. And of course the convoy, of course. I was about to say, let's see what the Germans will do, but we have to move the convoy first. Right, everyone hard to starboard and try and get out. Star shell? It is a star shell. Right. Are they... they, they, they are type 1936, aren't they? If I'm not mistaken. Ah, oh, that's not so good. Let's just check. 
Yeah, Type 1936A, class destroyers. Right, the good news is we've set a fire and we've damaged the propulsion and AAA heavily. Right, let's get those rear guns into play as well. Um, so they're saying 10.5 was a little bit long. Do I agree with that? Yeah, I'll go with that. I'll, I can go along with that. They've moved forward quite a bit. So I'll, only get, I'll drop it to 9... I'll actually drop it to 9.5. Shoot. All right, we've put a few more shells onto the target. Oh, we've got to be careful now. We don't want to do crashy-crashy with these. You you move slightly out of the way, then. 21.7, they're saying, was good. Was it? A little bit short, actually. We'll go 22.2 this time. Shoot! No, that was a little bit long. We were a little bit long with that one. This one's clear of any merchant ships, so I don't think we should see any problems there. Turn around falls down here, so if I go... And now they've dropped it to 22.5. Do you know what? I'll go 23.1 then. Shoot. If we're that close... See, 22.5, less than they said, and 23.1 was short, so... What were you expecting? You keep making smoke. And you guys just try your best to get out. The good news is, well, I guess it's good news and bad news at the same time. But, I guess... Um, the good news for the merchants is that they are... Oh, here we go. Um that they are, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Not being targeted by the, by the, the warships, by the destroyers. It's the escort that's getting the, um, the punishment here. Oh, I don't like this. And we've got torpedoes heading for us now as well. Can we see the torpedoes? I can't quite make them out. Regardless, however, this light cruiser should not be this close to the enemy ships. Therefore, we're going to go harder port. We're going to go harder port and try and get her away. Because they're too close. They are too close. We cannot have a light cruiser that close to the destroyers. Shoot! Are they gone? And they looked like they might want to. We can have destroyers be really close to destroyers, that's no problem. We don't mind that, but what we do mind is a light cruiser being so close. We've also got torpedoes heading straight for the light cruiser, so it's probably best if we, you know, alter our course at least somewhat. 15-2, I'm going to try 16-1. Shoot. Yeah, even 16-1 was short, so where they were going with 15-2, I've got absolutely no idea. So 23-1 was short, wasn't it? Let's try 23-3. Shoot. Yeah, good. That's two hits. We scored two hits. You continue making smoke. Convoy, meanwhile, you continue to run away as best as you can. Hopefully we can distract the destroyers or sink them outright. That'll save everyone. Right. Oh, here we go. 
Oh, not good. Not good. They've pelted the superstructure with 5.9-inch shells. That's what they've done here. And that those were waterline hits. That's why... said it once and I'll say it again. That's why we have to run away with the light cruiser. We've, we've got the pumps damaged. Oh, my goodness. Can we see the torpedoes heading in for us, perhaps? We can just about make a couple out there. Right, if I if I go harder port again, I'd like to think we can, you know, we can do something that way. Right, 8.4 was there. I'm going to go 7.7 seven this time. Even 7.6, go on. Shoot! Oh no, no, oh no, we can't be missing. Not with the light cruiser. We can miss with the destroyers, that's no problem, but not with the light cruiser. That's... No, that's really bad. 16-1 was... It wasn't a hit, though, was it? It was a little bit short. I'll try 15-9, then. Shoot. That's one hit. Move the uh, arrival along. 23-3. We scored hits with 23-3. They're saying 19-7. I'll, I'll go 21 then. Shoot. I just don't trust them when they when they drop their elevation estimates like that. It's almost certainly going to be, you know, long. I mean short, sorry. Right, maybe we can make smoke with you for one more turn, and then we can actually turn you in a little bit more. And you can provide some support to the light cruiser, actually. Because the light cruiser is getting bruised out here. Can we at least avoid the torpedoes? I think we will be able to do it. Now you see, that's better. Much better now. Much better this way, because this way they only have this small portion of the ship to fire at. Star shell from the Z-26. Yeah, we've still got the AAA damaged. I think... Yeah. Yeah, if we merely just move forward, well, that torpedo should sail right past us, I think. I'd like to think it will, anyway. Z-25, how's the Z-25 looking? Pretty beaten up, but they're still here. And that's not good. We don't want them to be here. Should we try 7-3? Or should we try the same thing again? Hmm. 7.6 was down here. I'm actually going to go 7.8 this time. I reckon we've moved away a little bit. Go on, 7.8. Shoot! Now we've moved more than a little bit away. And that's again... You do not want to be missing with the light cruiser. You, you don't want to be missing with anything. I guess. <laughs> if we're being really you know, strict about it. You don't want to miss with anything. But if you have to miss with something, don't miss with your most powerful ship. Now, even that was long. Why did they tell me 12.3 when I know that it's not going to hit? It's nowhere near the correct elevation. So then I have to guess myself. Why? Who, who would come up with that? Who would come up with that sort of system? Shoot! Hit! It's just one hit on the funnel. Not really going to be dealing any critical hits, I don't think. Hmm... 
Right, um, how are you doing? You're doing fine, you're undamaged pretty much. 10,950, right. What we'll do now then is we'll start to get you turned as well. I could have opened fire perhaps on this turn even. Let's get the get this convoy away. As best as we can. Here come the torpedoes. Oh, they've not quite made it. No, they're hitting the stern. It's bad because we've got the the um ouch. It's bad because we because we've got the pumps damaged, but it's well, as long as they're not... Oh, this one's still got all this exposed. Right, we propulsion's been hit and steering has been hit. How far away is this one? This one's really close. Should we or should we not? What do we reckon? Finish this one off or go after this one? No, I think it will... I think we'll even go after this one. Or should we not? That's the question. Yeah, I think we'll have to go for this one. Even though it's not something that we'd want to do. I don't like switching targets like that halfway through a fight, but unfortunately we have been forced to do so on this occasion. On this occasion, our hand has been very much forced. Let's try 7-9. Shoot. No, and that was... R no, well, it wasn't rubbish because we didn't really have anything better, but... It still leaves a lot to be desired. So 14 was... That was 14. 14 was long. I'll go 11-2 this time. No, I'll go 11-9 actually. Go on. Shoot. Good hits, perhaps. Oh, yes. Excellent. Oh, those were really good. Really nice. Get you moved along. 21-3. We scored one hit on the funnel, I think. On the last salvo. And they're saying 18 degrees. Um, I'm going to go 17-5. Shoot! I'm a little bit short. I think 18 would have done it. But here we go. We've got this destroyer now. That's the Eclipse. We'll have her turn around. And she will now open fire in support of the light cruiser. She'll deal with all these destroyers here that have... That are being very, very mean. Shooting at the light cruiser. We've hit this one. Have we hit this one by any chance, maybe? We've hit this one as well. Right. I think we'll deal with this one first. And the reason for that is she can unleash a broadside, whereas the um, Z Z25? Yeah, whereas the Z25 can't do that, at least not yet. 18.9 suggested. We'll go 18.7. 18.7 is right over here. Shoot! Almost, almost, almost. We almost did it then. Right, you guys continue to just turn around and run. Right, we've managed to avoid the torpedoes. But I'm not liking this broadside that's being un unleashed all the time. I'm not liking these broadsides. We like it when they miss. That's good. We like that. Here's what I really don't like, though. Look at them! That's why I switched fire to them, despite being reluctant to do so. That's why. That's the exact reason why. We'll slow you down to just two-thirds speed, I think. Just to 
in an attempt to at least somewhat control the flooding. So you're over here. We can unleash a broadside at you this time, which is good. And we've got information here that states that 8 degrees was a little bit short. So let's go 8.3 this time. Shoot. No, 8.3 was also short. 8.5 would have been devastating, I think. Eleven nine was good. I'll go eleven six maybe this time. Actually no. No, I go twelve one because we want to get at the other one. Shoot. The one that's unleashing all these broadsides. Right, Z twenty six is down here. Apparently we scored hits. I don't think we did. We'll go up to 17.8. Shoot! Mm, one hit. Not great. Let's do a slight turn just to make sure this destroyer doesn't actually collide with any of the merchants. Right, Z24. How's Z24 looking? Steering, sonar, heavy damage, AAA light damage. How's Z25 looking? Main spotter, main radar, AAA destroyed, sonar, heavy damage. Right. 18.7. Was over here. Let's try 18.2 this time. Fine, 17.7. Shoot. Two hits. Alright, and I think they can just sail forward now. Right, these are going to run out of steam, I think, very soon, if not on this turn. Come on, Trinidad. You hang on, please hang on. Right, is there 25 fires of star shell? Here's the one I'm annoyed at, though. Oh, only two turrets. And, I, and, I, and just a hit on the funnel. That's not too bad. 8.3 was again a little bit short, so we will actually go all the way up to 8.7 this time. In fact, 9.1. Let's go 9.1. Shoot. Right, we've got two hits on them. We would have wanted a little bit more, perhaps. Two hits isn't going to sink them. They're not 15-inch shells or 16 or 14-inch shells. If it was those, then yeah, you, you could you could make the point that two will be enough, but I don't quite think it will. Shoot. Oh, we're having an absolute field day here with these crash destroyers. You just take your pick, pretty much. Absolutely defenseless. Right, 17.8 was... Uh, Alright, I think. Let's try 18.2. Shoot! Because they are moving away, I think. But not that quickly. Not that quickly. Let's move the Eclipse forward. 17.7 was good. 17.8 maybe even. Shoot. Yeah, just one hit this time. Let's get these freighters away. Torpedoes in the water, they're going to run out. Well, there we go. That's... yeah, that's not good. Trinidad very much... yeah. We may lose the Trinidad. If things carry on like they are. 
Keep in mind the pumps are still damaged. We're not going to get the pumps back. Have we hit them in any major way? Well, not really. 9.1 was here. Let's try... I'll even say 10.1. Shoot! Get him! Yeah! There we go! So that's one of the destroyers down. We will actually pop over there just to check the damage, I think. What's the damage on the Z26? Alright, that's extensive damage now. Propulsion, steering, pumps... Aft torpedo tubes, ASW heavy damage, D turret AAA destroyed. Let's hop back to these ones over here. Was it 24? 12 2 was good. Let's just do 12 2 again. Shoot! I'm trying to hit both of them at the same time. <laughs> A little bit greedy, perhaps, on my part, but... Right, let's have you turn a little bit. 10 degrees. Right, um... Are you not firing at anyone? Has your ship been... Yes, it has. It has been sunk. Right, in that case then, you start shooting at the Z24. 26.9 suggested, I'll go 26.6. Shoot! Mm, almost, almost. I'm kind of tempted to launch torpedoes at them, to be quite honest. Hmm. Maybe. Let's try 17.4 this time. 17.3. Shoot! Come on, they can't stand up forever. They can't be doing this forever. They have to sink eventually. Speaking of sinking, Trinidad may be sinking soon. I hope she doesn't. I really, really hope she doesn't, but... Something tells me that that is a very distinct possibility. Right, just pelt them with 6-inch shells, I think, at this point. So what's number one? Number one was 7.6. I'd say 7.5 then. Oh, but we've moved away, haven't we? Let's do 8.1 then. Shoot! Yeah, we've moved away even further than that. Twelve point two. Fire again. So that's one of the destroyers gone. How was that the Z-25? Was it the Z-24? No, it was the Z-25. Z-25 is gone. Main spotter, main radar, and AAA have all been destroyed. Right, well that means all we need to do now is sink the Z... Oh no, that's the, that's the Trinidad. No, we don't want to be shooting at the Trinidad. Um, we just need to sink the Z-24 now then. And we will have saved the convoy. Let's try 27-1. Shoot. Almost, almost. Almost. Right, 17-3 was... Yeah, not too bad. 
shoot. Yeah, that goes to Z24. Excellent. Z24 damage. Pumps, aft spotter, aft radar, sonar, four torpedo tubes, all those with heavy damage, and AAA with... L well, with complete damage, because it's destroyed. Sinking slowly, or... Or stubbornly. Man, this looks like a stubborn sinking to me. In that case, then, let's hop over to the Trinidad, which I've got a feeling will be scuttled, but... So, let's... One last look. How about that? Action report. On the British side, the light cruiser Trinidad received heavy damage, but pulled through. She survived. And the destroyer's Fury Arabi and Eclipse received no damage. Two merchant ship large freighters received no damage. Two C2 freighters received no damage. Merchant ship Liberty freighter no damage. And one merchant ship large freighter no damage. On the German side, the attack was repulsed. The destroyers Z24, Z25 and Z26 were sunk for 2,600 tons each. That's a score of 7,800. And that is all from Admiral Polarovsky for this video. If you enjoy the content I put out, leave a like and subscribe. If you have a custom battle suggestion that you would like to see me turn into a video, drop a comment below and I will have your suggestion up within a day or two. Thank you for watching this video. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye bye for now.